Ryan McCaffrey here with IGN. I'm at Respawn Entertainment. We are checking out Star Wars Jedi Survivor all month long as part of IGN First. Jeff, your design director for Star Wars Jedi Survivor. Thanks for having us. Yeah, thanks for coming. What are we checking out here? There, are, There's a lot going on in this game. We've played a lot of it. We'll be talking about it all month long. Uh, what particular section are we looking at here? We're looking at a Jedi meditation chamber, which is uh, one of the many types of side content that you can find while exploring uh, one of our planets on Jedi Survivor. Well, let's, let's dive in here and take a look at it. So you want to get, there is a clear endpoint and let's, uh, we're not going to re reveal and ruin everything, but you're going to need to use your force powers, such as on this, this switch here, which moves this uh, little rolling track along. And uh, we're going to have to stack, just stack some knowledge together, right? To That's figure right. This out. Yeah, there's, there's multiple things you can interact with with the force in here. There's these, these batteries uh, that you can plug in and they create these bridges that allow you to traverse uh, the, like large expanses of, of okay. this area. Uh, is it fair to say this is, this is a, a, a puzzle room of sorts? Yeah, it's um, kind of a change of pace of gameplay for people that want to dive deep into puzzle type gameplay. Um, we've got some puzzles along the main path as well, but for the people who really like puzzles and want to get some more of it, we've got uh, meditation chambers for them. And are these all optional, or is this, this, we're looking at the first one in the game. Uh, this is actually uh, the first optional one. There, okay. is, there is one on Critical Path. Got it. Um, but this one uh, you can stumble upon in one of our regions on uh, our main planet, Kobo. So first of all, you can say, I mean, art-wise, this is a very cool, distinct-looking place. Uh, what would you, how would you describe the artistic vibe here within the context of the Star Wars universe? Well, these are, Ancient uh, chambers, they've been around on this planet for hundreds of years. Um, and it is a location where, where Jedi of the past would train and test their, their, um, their Jedi abilities. All right, so we're going over here to this other side. Another thing here is we have uh, force echoes and scans where Cal can learn information about Jedi of the past who tried these challenges, maybe yeah. failed, maybe succeeded. Um, just characters in the past who were trying to, to hone their Jedi skills just like you are. So this, this one isn't particularly platformy, but you know, platforming is definitely a, a big element in Jedi Fallen Order. I suspect will probably be the case again in, in certain sections of Jedi Survivor. Are, is it fair to say that, that the different Jedi chambers will test different skills as you solve their puzzles? Yeah, we have all of our types of of gameplay mixed in within the puzzles, although puzzling is the primary aspect of these chambers. Um, Cal's gonna have to use his traverse abilities as well as his force abilities, um, maybe even combat abilities uh, to complete uh, these different different chambers. Now, it's fair to ask, the, are the rewards worth it for players? Because, you know, for some, some people, if you just get, eh, you know, a, a new piece of outfit for Cal, like, eh, maybe a I don't want to bother with the chamber. <laughs> yeah, but, but sometimes maybe the reward in certain things could be a skill point or, or something, you know, really tangible to your, to your character. So are, would you say that the, the Jedi chambers have, a, have pretty, pretty solid rewards in them? Absolutely, yeah. Um, one of our new types of rewards this game um, are called perks. So perks are uh, abilities that you can slot in to um, the perk system, and they can actually change your game gameplay, customize Cal's gameplay, uh, mostly in combat. So we really wanted to focus on um, focus on uh, really tangible uh, rewards this time for exploration. So yes, we're going to have lots of cosmetic, a deep cosmetic system to customize Cal. Um, but also we want to be able to customize the gameplay style. That was a quick look at the Jedi Chambers in Star Wars Jedi Survivor. Don't miss our nine minute gameplay video that we kicked off our IGN first month with. And for much more, stay tuned all month long to IGN.